Hello, hello, my wonderful friends. I am coming to you once again glowing from a morning run on the beach. Isn't it beautiful out here? It really and truly is. But today I wanna to talk about what happens when you really miss out. Um, you know, I talk about opportunities coming around again and that when an opportunity comes around again, it's gonna be very different than it was the first time. There's also those moments where you think you see something and you kind of discount it because maybe you didn't like it in the past. Hello, asparagus, I've got a good asparagus story for you. Um, or maybe you discount it because you're like, oh, that's not something I'm really into. Frozen yogurt isn't my jam. I love ice cream, but frozen yogurt, mm, not so much. So anyway, on my run this morning, this is the second time I've done this run, I came out earlier because the first time I ran, it was really, really hot. And hey, by the way, if we haven't met yet, my name is Irina Miller. I'm an intuitive energy coach and I've been guiding women for over 20 years in how to tune in to the messages, the signs all around them so that they don't miss out. So getting back to opportunity and running, I love, love, love to get up early. I love to move my body. And the first time I was running, I was noticing it's hot, I'm not sure where I'm going. I'm taking in a little bit of the sights, figuring out what's going on. But it's kind of like the first time you watch one of these, you know, Avenger or X-Men type movies, you miss little details. Or that movie Get Out. Have you guys seen Get Out? If you have, let me know in the comments. My son has watched that like a million times and it's so much fun to watch with him because he knows all the little subtle messages that are being shared that unless you know, you kind of miss out on it. And you watch it the first time, you're like, oh, that was a great movie. But you missed so much, so you wanna watch it again and again and again. So there's that practice that comes up, repetition. Um, being from a long yoga practice, um, practicing for over 30 years, teaching for over 20, I know that it is through practice and repetition that your awareness increases and you can con continue to engage and have those moments of revelation. There's times of concealment and times of revelation. So this morning on my run, what I realized was sometimes we really miss out if we only look at something once or we only try something once. As I was running, I ran by everything that I ran by two days ago and I noticed, oh, here's a place where I could write, rent bikes and scooters. I ran by this two days ago, but I never saw it. Then, not long after that, I ran by a little kind of surf shop selling frozen yogurt and I thought, oh, frozen yogurt, okay, that's good to know, but you know, frozen yogurt. And so I ran by it, but on the way back, what happened was I checked out the places again because I wanted to mark in my memory, where are they? What other landmarks are around them? So if I walk back with my family or I make them run, um, I could find these delicious, you know, frozen yogurts, they like frozen yogurts. Maybe rent a scooter with my son and have some fun. Hi, Lori, great to have you. Lori's an amazing beach person. You know all the great things about the beach. Ah, I'm glad you're here. So when I was running back, I saw that wonderful little surf shop with the frozen yogurt. But then all of a sudden, running in the other direction, I saw the sign for hand rolled ice cream. Ooh, that caught my attention. Frozen yogurt didn't. Why didn't I see it the first time? And I thought, wow, they only put it on this one sign and you can only see it from the other direction? Hmm. But I kept running and I saw that it was also on the storefront of the sign. It was just on the right instead of the left. Frozen yogurt was on the left. But I missed the hand rolled ice cream and I thought, okay, but still that's easier seen when you're running from the second direction I was running back. And I thought, all right, well, that's good. They have it in multiple places. And then right on the sidewalk, I kid you not, was a sign, a little billboard for hand rolled ice cream. There were at least three messages for hand rolled ice cream. And actually I only saw one for frozen yogurt when I really looked. And I thought, how in the world did I miss all the ice cream and only see the yogurt? This is crazy. So there are moments that we do miss out and maybe miss out on something we would really, really love. So what I encourage you to do is repetition go back, have fun, keep checking things out because even though it might seem like the same old, same old, you know, think of that movie Groundhog's Day. It really could have been the same thing exactly in repetition, except Bill Murray's character started having fun with this repetitive cycle and he started changing things. So even though it might seem like the same old cycle of waking up and brushing your teeth and driving to work and you know, having breakfast, blah, 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 sitting at the desk, rinse and repeat, you know, there are wonderful things that are happening all around you that you might be missing out on, 
because you're stuck in this automatic rote recycle. And I invite you to take a moment, open your eyes and check out what's going on around you and see if you catch something new, but be open to all the possibilities as one of my teachers says, and you know, have some fun. All right, so I'm gonna have some fun today. There is a red and purple flag up. Holy cannoli, mm, it's um, an interesting day, right? So I'll, I'll figure out what to do with the surf. The red flag, of course, means dangerous currents, riptides, and then the purple are marine pests, I found out. Really, really fascinating, but they're jellyfish, woo! They were coming out last night, that's why we were getting stung. <laughs> so I hope you have a wonderful day. I'm gonna be playing with the jellyfish and avoiding rip currents and staying very close to the shoreline. Have a wonderful day, and hey, by the way, come join me in my group. I'd love to have you over there, because um, you're definitely missing out if you're not over there. We do lots of fun stuff. And thanks for all the love, Lori. So much love to you. Bye, guys. Catch you on the flip side.